Hello, it's Susan Duclos with All News Pipeline. It's November 18, 2014. We're over at the Nuclear Emergency Tracking Center. Now, what you're looking at here is Bakersfield, California, and 382 CPM, which is extremely high. Um, I'll go ahead and stick that chart again in the article associated with this video so you can see exactly how high above the normal range it is. But California isn't what we're actually going to talk about here because as many believe that the high numbers in California is due to the Fukushima meltdowns that happened in 2011 after the earthquake and tsunami. But what I want to point out is St. Charles, Illinois. Take a look at these numbers. Right now, it says it's 2,273 CPMs. That's counts per minute in St. Charles, Illinois. And the high was at 5,554. Average over the last 10 minutes, 2,476. And these were taken on 1118. 2014 was the last update on this. So I thought we would go over and take a look at, I'm not sure this is the reason, I'm just pointing it out. Everybody else can come up to their own uh, conclusions here. Hang on a second, let's go to the other site. Okay, we're at the um, NRC, government. It shows the locations of operating nuclear plants power reactors by location and name and here's the map now you'll see there's very few over here but take a look at the east coast specifically around Illinois we have a lot of uh, power reactors in that area help the whole east coast and Midwest here as you can see could there be a problem that nobody's being told about with one of those reactors that's causing the extremely high levels of uh, radiation readings in Illinois. Just something to think about, <clears throat> something to research a little more. Have at it folks in the comment sections.